If you've decided on a name for your blog, it's time to register a domain and get a web hosting account. The domain registration process is pretty straightforward. Just go to the registrar of your choice, look up the domain you want, add it to your cart, and check out. Side note, many hosting companies also sell domains, so if you'd like to get your domain and hosting from the same place, you can totally do that. As for hosting, you'll find there are several options. There's shared hosting, which is ideal when you're just starting out because it's cheap, and in fact, most blogs can continue to run well on shared hosting for quite a while. Then there are virtual private servers and dedicated servers, which give you more power and dedicated resources that you don't have to share with other customers. That's something you might consider as your blog grows and needs to support a larger audience. There's also managed WordPress hosting, a service increasingly offered by many of the big hosting companies, as well as a couple of dedicated WordPress hosts such as WP Engine and Synthesis. These are used by a lot of serious bloggers who don't want to deal with things like site performance and backups, and they're worth checking out if you fall into that category. Here's some of the web hosts I recommend.